What's up, my YouTube family? And today we're going to be talking about the VMAs award show that happened the other night. And I'm going to say, I was back and forth with it. I mean, I was watching one program and then I switch it back to the, to the VMAs. It's like, it wasn't grabbing my attention. Like, if it wasn't like a Beyonce on stage or a, a, um, a Future or somebody, you know, just somebody bigger than what they had on stage that night. I didn't. It, 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 it didn't. It didn't get my attention. You know, a little. A little well, I, well, I would say I take it back. A few artists got my attention. You know, I don't know their their, their names. I felt a little old. So I'm like, who is this person? Where I, I don't. I never seen them before. But they win these awards. They get on. They get on stage and singing these songs. So, you know, I just kind of say, okay, okay. They sound pretty. They sound all right. Sound all right. And um, that's when the performances that I thought really stuck out. To me, was Nicki Minaj. Nicki Minaj did a really, really good job. It was, a, it was almost like I want to give you this bullshit, this bull crap ass song, but I'm gonna give you something real. And I feel like that that song that she has off her album, I don't know the name of it, but it was really, really like New York. It gave you that that New York vibe, like that Biggie vibe, like yeah, yeah, uh, you know how she, you know y'all know how she do. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> But you know, it, it was pretty good. I liked it. You know, um, Ariana Grande. Uh, I don't think she was singing live. I think she may have pre-recorded that. You know, just like a few other people have. You know, that we've seen on some of these different award shows. She looked pretty. You know, she looked pretty. Um, I was happy for Travis Scott. You know, hey, because I'm a I'm a fan of Travis Scott, Mr. Travis Scott. Um, Car oh yeah, Car I forgot about I forgot about that Cardi Cardi B. Cardi B looked really really nice. Like she, it's like her snapback game was just like 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 that. She got a little thicker. Like wow, she's already been thicker, but it's just like them thighs just seem like thing like to me. They got a little thicker, a little thickums over there. Wow, look good. It look it, it look really really good. Like whoever is her stylist, keep that person because they are having you looking like money, and you already you do have money now, but man. You've been like looking like money, but you look like more like a, a rich girl, Miss Miss something that's gonna poke her hand, poke her finger out, and she's and she sip her tea. <laughs> One of those types. Yep. Um, Jennifer Lopez. Oh my goodness, J Lo. Yeah, J Lo was doing it. She was killing it. I thought she was singing live, but, but some people say that she wasn't singing live. And it's all right, cause I mean, she's J Lo. We all know she can sing. Shoot. Um. And she brought out um, Ja Rule. They should have brought out Ashanti. She was in the audience, in the audience, recording off her phone. I thought it was off the shade room. They was, and she was singing a song right, right along with them on stage. I'm like, man, you should have had her on stage. Come on now, it's her song. I think she wrote it. Um, who else? Tatiana Taylor. She didn't perform, but she looked really, really nice. Um, Black China, Black China looked nice too. Um, uh, Twenty One Savage looked kind of plain, really, really plain and basic. Um, Kylie Jenner, she really looked, you know, that's the billion dollar woman right there. That's a billion dollar woman. She looked like money. I mean, just, you know how they do. She looked like she got some money. Like, wow, you look really, really good. Um, uh, who else? I'm missing somebody. I'm trying to think. Who else did I, that, that stuck out to me more? Oh, yeah, Tiffany and Kevin Hart. So these Negroes got on stage and they was, you know, I like Kevin Hart. Tiffany, I'm not too much of a big fan of her because I don't feel like it's, she's that amusing to me. Like, it's not that hilarious at all. But, you know, to each of own, she got a nice hustle. But when she said, oh, y'all know I can't read, it's like, you know I can't read. Why are you making a mockery of what they already think of us anyways? Like, come on now. Come on now. Why you do that? Dang. That was just so, that was just one of those... Let me get my tap suit dance on, and we're gonna be tapping for these people out here. You know, I don't want to say that word, but you know, that was just tap dancing right there. That was just some tap dancing blackface, like my, my like my other subscriber said, Justin J said. It was just a blackface right there. Just they just might as well should have been black blackface because <laughs> it was it was terrible. It was terrible. I didn't like it. I felt like damn, and the jokes was just flat. They fail. They feel she tries too hard to me. If you ask me, Kevin Hart, he's an, he's a he's he's a veteran to this now. He been doing shit for years, just like she has. But he's he's a lot stronger in it than she is. Um, who else? Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Ma oh, Madonna. 
Madonna, you, you talked about a week about four or five, a couple of seconds, and then that was it. You got on to yourself. You, you start talking about yourself. It's like somebody that, that had a past, but then that person that had past, they end up talking about themselves. Well, I used to do this with this. I used to do this and do that. Just like she did. We ain't talking about you, baby girl. We're talking about Aretha. But I guess you, you know, with age, you just got off track and forgot about all that. You know, hey, whatever it is, what it is. But one thing I want to say, you know, this award show was horrible. It was really, really horrible. And besides Nicki Minaj and Carly B, you know, she didn't perform, but she looked good. Um, and and J Lo, that they saved it a little bit. They saved a little bit of the show because at the beginning of the show, it was a snooze fest. Like I feel like I was going to sleep. You know, that's why I kept flipping the channels because it was like it's not interesting. Like this sounds like something that they did last year. Same old, same old, same old. You know, hopefully for the BET Awards, the Grammys, the bounce, um, bounce with uh, not bounce, but um. What do you call that? Um, um, Soul Train Awards. Hopefully, they get these other award shows that's coming up can get it together because time is ticking. We already in August. We finna go into the September and another, another more and almost a few more days. So come on now. I think it's just it's it's about it's, it needs, we need to change it up. We need to switch it up because oh, we need to buy the diversity was not there last night. From what I see, it wasn't there. It wasn't at all. But yeah. Hopefully they can come back. I don't know what they're going to do. I don't know what they're going to do.